Hey there! It is highly unlikely that we will get Android P update in future because there are only less than 2% Android phones which have got Android Oreo. So let's forget about getting the Android P. But what if you want to get the look of Android P and some good features of it? Let me help you with that. So right now in front of me is my daily driver OnePlus 3T which has Android Oreo. But it looks like Android P. I'll show you how you can make your phone look almost like Android P. But first, let me take you back to how it was looking before. This is my usual launcher which I'm using right now. Everything you need to make your phone look like Android P is given below in the description box. So make sure to download all those files first. The first step is you have to install the Android P launcher. It's a small 5MB APK, it's pretty stable, haven't given me any issues till now. Make sure you have already given the permissions to install the third party applications. And the only step now left is to set the pixel launcher as your default home. You see, there is the new dock which is in the Android P. And I think rest of the launcher is same as Android Audio launcher. The date widget on the top is still functional when you tap on it and also the weather widget. If you know that Android P is getting a new volume slider, here is how you can get that too. Just install the APK file which I have attached in the description. Now open up the app and set the volume slider as Android P. There is a small quirk with this app that you cannot use your volume buttons with it. You'll have to swipe down from the top and then choose which volume slider you want to use. Although you cannot use volume buttons with it but now you can see 7 different types of volume sliders. You may or may not like this process of changing the volume but it's totally up to you and you can skip this part if you don't like using this method. Next step is to make screen corners rounded like Google Pixel phones. Just go to the app store and search for the app called Corner Fly. Once you install it, you have to give it some permissions and turn on the rounded corner. That's it. It does not require anything more and you are good to go. Also, if you have an Android phone which has AMOLED screen, then the rounded corners will look even better because the pixels of AMOLED screen turns completely off to show true black. Now again we have to go back to the Play Store and install the Google's own wallpaper application and you will know why soon. After installing it, you don't need to open it right now. Just go to your downloads folder and install the Pixel Life wallpaper APK. It's a big APK with more than 100 MB in size but I think it's worth it. After this step you need to go to the home page and hold on until you see the wallpaper changing option. This will open up the Google wallpaper application which you just installed right now. Scroll down until you see the live wallpaper section, pick up any wallpaper you want and now you have made your phone look almost like Android P. But there are still few things left to install, please stay with me. Android P is coming with a new feature called Markup. It lets you edit screenshots quickly to point out something on the image. Just install this APK and then take a screenshot of anything. Once that is done, swipe down from the top and tap on the share button under the screenshot notification. Click on the markup button and you will see it is not working. I don't know why but it is not working properly on my phone. But if I go into my photos and then open up the screenshot I took right now, the markup feature will work completely fine with no issues. I have seen that other phones are not getting any issues when they swipe down from the notification section. If you know how to fix it for the OnePlus 3T, please let me know and I'll give you one internet point which is awesome. And the last step is you can install all the Android P ringtones and copy them into the ringtones folder which is in your internal storage. If you like this helpful video then please share it with your friends, let them also know and share with them. And also subscribe to this channel, hit that bell icon and I'll come back with more awesome videos. Until then, take care of these pixels.